I'll just get that door for you. There you go. And we are off. Nice night for a drive, eh, miss? Tonight, of course, being August 31st, 1997. <laughs> Any particular music you want to listen to? <laughs> Princess Diana? <laughs> There was a whole second bit I had planned with Courtney where you find out she's still alive and everything's fine. I swear. Hi, I'm Big Bird, and this is an alternate universe where I was in the Challenger disaster. <laughs> oh my god! I no longer feel bad. Yeah. Oh man! This is brought to you by our planet and VH1. Once upon a time, there was a little girl who lived on a planet, Pepperzonia. Her mother is a crow. She must find love on this planet where no one exists. Also, she is blind. I can't do this. I cannot. Look at her toes. <laughs> Mm -mm. All right. <sighs> and we're off. Sure is a nice day for a drive. Today, of course, being June 28, 1914, at around 10.45 a.m. in the morning. Wouldn't you agree, Archduke Franz Ferdinand of Austria? <laughs> hey, look! A teenager! Uh-oh, what's he pulling out there? What's he got? Oh, no, it's a yo-yo. <laughs> this is an alternate timeline where you were never assassinated, thus resulting in World War I never happening. That would then lead to a one-world government led by none other than, you guessed it, Matthew Perry. <laughs> wow. Here we are on the Mayflower. Just a couple months until we get to our destination. Hey, how about a song to pass the time? Well, we're heading to the new world. We're going across the sea. We're gonna meet the natives there. I bet they're gonna be really cool. We're all gonna be best friends. There's no way that this country will be disappointing ever. We're never gonna hurt anyone. We're never gonna take advantage of any people. I bet we're gonna all be best friends forever. Time. <laughs> That's right, yeah. I knew I, I had to be, I knew I had to go dark humor with